Thank you to Mr. Tuzi for invitation and good afternoon for the others. Itche PIP combined PIP Itche in osteoarthritis. The disease is characterized by degeneration of cartilage joint and subconal bone, adaptive change in the synovian ligaments and tendons. Neosteoarthritis is a heterogeneous disease associated with comorbidities which complicates the standardization of clinical studies. The current treatments for OA are palliative and symptomatic rather than influencing the biochemical environment of the joint. We are entering into an era of biology treatment. Visco supplementation, HA, platelet rich plasma, PRP, visco PRP, all in one. Hyaluronic acid from which yellow, which means glassy, and uronic is a glycosaminoglycan distributed in synovial fluid and component of the extracellular matrix of cartilage. Its use as visco supplement in the osteoarthritis starts at the end of the 20th century. Visco supplementation is a procedure that involves injecting a jet light substance into the knee to supplement the natural lubricant in the joint. Hyaluronic acid helps protect the joint by increasing the viscosity of synovial fluid. The use of HA is widely documented in the EBM literature in osteoarthritis called dry. Apart from the use of five monthly injections with historical HA yalgo, there is a consensus of visceral supplementation protocol of three weekly injections per year, cyclic repeat treatment. The opportunity of one-shot treatment came later. HA class effect. Different HA showed no superiority, effectiveness, and safety in terms of volume, concentration, molecular weight, linear or cross-link configuration, rate of administration, or viscoelasticity. HA as an alternative to NSAIDs. Ishijima and Cole compared in a recent non inferiority randomized study intraarticular HA injection versus oral and said dodge for the treatment of neosteoarthritis. No statistical difference in efficacy at three months in two groups. Stop frequency of treatment HA lower than NSAIDs. Banu and Carl in meta-analysis showed no difference in efficacy between HA and oral NSAIDs at 4 and 12 weeks. Pain at the injection site was the most frequently reported event for HA. Gastrointestinal adverse effects were most frequent for NSAIDs. HA chondromulator effect. HA decreased cytokine in vitro activity of interleukin 1 in synovial membrane. HA decreased radiologic progression of joint space narrowing. HA decreased CTH2 urinary biomarker of collagen degradation. HA reduced the loss of cartilage volume, medial and lateral compartment MRI. HA decreased the progression of arthroscopic cartilage damage score. HA reduced need for knee replacement with increased cerebral curve kaplan mayer HA belongs to the therapeutic strategy for patients with knee osteoarthritis. Recent work by Miller and Block confirms the efficacy and safety of HA approved by the FDA. HA delays the use of prosthetic surgery and reduces the medical and economic cost. 2013 AAOS guidelines do not recommend the use of viscous supplementation. Inconclusive in 28, it is not possible to underestimate the major conflict of interest of American orthopedics. American orthopedics operate more often and earlier in knee osteoarthritis than in France. Since they have opportunities to practice transplant of cartilage in the context of surgical procedure, they reduce their use of hyaluronic acid injection. Methodological errors and inconsistency of some results of the ORC 2014 recommendation promote the controversy. 
It is the same for the use of the results of the roots meta-analysis. A careful reading of this meta-analysis would have revealed it that tolerance was considered on eight of the 71 studies selected, posing at least a methodological problem. HA controls pain and inflammation. HA helps restore joint function. HA prevents degeneration of articular cartilage. PRP. In the 21st century, autologous PRP has emerged as a treatment option for tendinopathy and chronic ones. In addition to really the growth factors, PRP also promotes concentrated anti-inflammatory signals, including interleukin-1 receptor antagonist, which has been a focus of emerging treatments for osteoarthritis. PRP is an autologous blood fraction recovered after centrifugation in the supernatal plasma. It was demonstrated that a single centrifugation step is sufficient to obtain fraction rich in platelets. PRP is not a label blood product. PRP is not considered a performance enhancing drug by law. A blood sample prior to the treatment by PRP is highly recommended comprising HB more than 11, PLT more than 1050, VS less than 10, CRP less than 5. Platelets can be activated by artificial endogenous factors or endogenous factors after articular, articular infiltration. In this slide, you can see platelets anatomy during PRP activation. Platelet concentration is approximately 1.5 to 2.5 times that contained in the native blood to achieve in vitro positive effects on osteoblast and fibroblast. A concentration of platelets three to five times that contained in the native blood reduce the effects of growth factor. Platelet secretum comprises over 200 organic products, including growth factors, anti-inflammatory cytokines. PRP stimulates cartilage matrix synthesis. PRP suppresses anti-inflammatory response. At present, PRP is highly variable across the different systems of the market. The ideal composition of PRP should contain a minimal amount of red, white cells, and not excessive platelet concentration. On this slide, you can see an optimal example of PRP. The protocol for sampling, extraction, and injection must follow the most stringent aesthetic condition. The use of anti-inflammatory drugs and sets is not recommended during treatment with PRP 10 days before and 21 days after. The extension of local anesthetic at the site of treatment is not conducive to tissue regeneration. The great variability in the composition of PRP as well as the individual variability in serum platelet and the lack of standardization of PRP in clinical study make it difficult to compare. On this slide, you can find nine positive randomized studies with high level of scientific evidence in osteoarthritis. In all these studies, PRP is better than HA and HA better than PBO. Use of PRP therapy is not a validated option of for knee osteoarthritis treatment. All data in the literature agrees on the lack of side effects with the exception of temporary aesthetic painful knee swelling. Visco PRP, PRP in addition with HA in osteoarthritis. HA boosts the effect of PRP. PRP promotes suppression of endogenous HA. Cellular matrix is a class three innovative medical device combines autologous PRP to milliliter by small sample of blood for milliliter, non crosslink HA 1.5 million Dalton, 2 milliliter fermented concentration 20 milligram per milliliter, 
dispatch the BCT tube. On this slide, the first step is sample blood and centrifugation. Cellular matrix use gel technology for cell separation. Five minutes centrifugation at 3,400 RPM. High platelet recovery, 60-70%. Partial recovery of white blood cells, 15%. Selective depletion of granulocyte, 90%. No red blood contamination, 0.5%. Cellular matrix is the first model of bioengineering technique. RPP meets with HA at 50% ratio. Platelet suspension in three dimensional scaffold. Concentration near physi physiological blood value with PLT integrity and functionality to release a cocktail of growth factor and anti inflammatory cytokines. Top down in this slide, you can see. HA, PRP, gel separator, red bloods, red cells, excuse me. Uh, you see uh, the technical of uh, pumping aspiration for mix HA with PRP and before injection. On this slide, it's a protocol VRP. And step by step, collecting, centrifugation, resuspension, with control movement and pumping aspiration. VPRP, there is no standardization of protocol VSCOPRP. We can propose three injections, space one, two weeks, one time per month, or three times per semester. It's possible to make a one-shot injection given early analgesic and anti-inflammatory effect. Cellular matrix is a method effective, safe, simple, fast, low cost. In conclusion, HA, despite recent controversy, remains an essential treatment of conservative medical management for knee osteoarthritis. PRP, despite the heterogeneity of products and protocols, is a safe and effective treatment option in the osteoarthritis. VPRP, all-in-one PRP combined with HA, is a scientific evidence of its additive synergy of action. This technique is simple, fast, efficient, and secure. The future is moving towards a pre preventive biomedicine and earlier use of this analgesic and regenerative combination. However, further randomized studies are needed against PBO and especially with structural study of articular cartilage by MRI. Thank you for your attention.